Hi! Today I want to share with you my favorite method of making repeats using traditional media. If you are new to my channel, my name is Paulina Osho. I am an artist and a surface pattern designer. Here I show drawing videos and some tutorials. You are very welcome to subscribe. Ok, all you need for this method is paper and any tool for drawing. It's easy to create a repeat using just a piece of paper. You do not need to cut anything. It's a helpful and simple method to create a repeat motif in a traditional way or just a fun way to sketch for a digital pattern. If you are new to surface pattern, this exercise can help you to understand better how seamless patterns work. After your paper tile is finished, you can scan it and edit it digitally to make a working file to be printed on any surface, but that's another story. So, let's start. Take a blank piece of paper. You can use white paper or choose any other color. It can be a rectangle, but I prefer to use squares. The size is up to you. Just keep in mind that if you want to scan it later, the paper should not be larger than your scanner. Draw the elements of your future pattern in the middle of the sheet. Do not cross the edges, it's important. Turn over your sheet, fold the left and right sides of the paper to the center. Now you can fill more elements in the middle, which is blank. Don't forget to stay away from the top and bottom edges of the paper. Unfold left and right. Fold the top and bottom edges to the center.
draw elements on the blank space. Stay away from the edges. Unfold and go over. Check the whole tile. If any big empty spaces are left, fill them. That's all, it's ready. If you want to continue the work digitally, scan the paper. You can make edits in Adobe Photoshop and prepare the file for printing. You may know that there is another method of making a repeat. It's a paper cutting method. I find this folding one more convenient. But if you want, I can make a video about that one too. Let me know. I hope it was helpful for you. If you have any questions or just want uh, to give me some feedback, please feel free to leave a comment. I'll try to make more of such content if you are interested. Thank you for watching. Bye!